President Trump continuing to slam liberal leaders as violence continues to plague many of these Democrat-run cities. Here's One America's Sani Unatoa. <laughs> Violence has intensified in cities across the U.S. Following the death of George Floyd in May and others involved in alleged instances of police brutality. The president has continually condemned the violence, saying the thuggery is happening in Democrat-run cities because of weak and poor leadership. I looked at Pittsburgh, I looked at Rochester, I looked at L.A. last night, I looked at these Democrat-run cities. Now you look at Portland every night, they don't have the strength, they don't have the... the the De I don't think the Democrats have the courage to control these people. President Trump says the rioters and looters are not peaceful protesters, as, quote, Sleepy Joe and the Democrats call them. Instead, he said they're thugs, and the violence is all taking place in Democrat-run cities. He's taken aim at his rivals, saying Joe Biden and his running mate Kamala Harris won't even utter the words law and order. They're afraid to even talk about law and order. They can't issue the words law and order. All we want is law and order. He also warns violence will quickly spread to the suburbs under a Biden administration, and it will be the end of the American dream. The suburbs are next. If you elected this guy, the suburbs would be overwhelmed with violence and crime. The president has linked the Democrat presidential nominee to the destructive unrest across the nation, and he's calling on leaders of Democrat-run cities to request federal help, saying we will solve your problems in a matter of minutes. Sunny Unutoa, One America News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube, and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.